Let us begin with an overview of the pine chemicals which we are working on. The word pine, of course, comes from the pine tree, and chemicals refers to the various products made using chemical processes. Pine chemicals refers to the chemical products derived from pine trees through chemical process. The pine tree, like other trees, performs photosynthesis, a process by which solar energy transforms carbon dioxide and water into the oxygen we humans and other life depend on for survival. At the same time, pine trees absorb water and nutrients through their roots, subsequently growing and synthesizing cellulose, a fiber material and chemical substances. A stable supply of sunlight and water, coupled with constant plantation, will ensure that this natural chemical factory never runs out, making the pine tree a truly remarkable, renewable resource. So what kind of chemical substances can we obtain from a pine tree? Distillation of crude gum, which is a viscose liquid exuded from the incisions of the pine tree, can produce rosin, a resin, and turpentine, a solvent. Although turpentine has been used for oil paintings, it was also widely used as a solvent for paints before the appearance of petrochemical-based products. The pine tree contains fatty acids in the form of oil. The tall oil fatty acids indicated in the diagram are classified as fatty acids obtained from the pine tree. Tall, in this case, means pine in Swedish. Harima processes these substances into intermediate chemical products utilized by various industrial fields. Three methods are employed to extract pine chemicals from the pine tree. The oldest and most well-known technique is to collect exuded crude gum by tapping live pine trees and then separating it into gum rosin and turpentine by distillation. The second method involves extracting wood rosin from pine stumps using solvent. The third method is the distillation of tall oil, which is a byproduct of the pulp-making process. Distilling tall oil produces tall oil rosin and tall oil fatty acids. Rosin and fatty acids have a wide range of applications. For printing inks, rosin is used to uniformly adhere pigments to paper and other substrates. In the paint industry, Fatty acids are used as raw materials for manufacturing alkyd resins. Resin is also an essential component of soldering paste. And for synthetic rubbers such as tires, rosin is used as an emulsifier for manufacturing styrene butadiene rubber. <laughs> 